All right, I'm gonna show you guys how to uh, skin a uh, squirrel here, how to field dress it, and we're also gonna be doing a review of the uh, Remington uh, knife series blades here. So um, I showed you guys on my Facebook page that I got these. I uh, really wanted to try them out. Check that out. That's just one of them. They're completely uh, 440 stainless steel. Uh, really nice knives and super sharp. I've already gutted a deer with it and so I know they work well. Um, this is a really hard this is a really hard case. Um, a sheath actually. And uh, this is one of the skinny knives there. And then you have your nice uh, flushing knife. So this is really, really nice. Um, and dishwasher safe, so that works for me. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and get our little small knife here. All right, I'm gonna show you how to uh, field dress a squirrel here. So the first thing you're gonna do is get them over sideways there on their back. And uh, in this case, I have a male, so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna cut the legs off. Cut the legs off. There we go, that's one. And there's the other. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and cut right up the middle, the inside, just like you do a deer there. So, cut right up the middle here. And really make sure that, that cut is nice and smooth there. Alright. Go over the same leg. I mean the other leg. And you want to really be uh, thoughtful about where you're putting that knife. Because it's just, it is as sharp as can be. And keep cutting through. It helps if you can tie them down, but here I'm just kind of looking just like that. So you want to lay them flat, flat as you can get. Got a little cooker bug there. Now you want to bring both of those cuts right up to just above. In this case, it would be the, the penis. It's the male. And go right up to the, the belly there. All right, now, now I have to, after I've done that, you could castrate him. Castrate him right off. Take that off. And you see that urine there, that urine bag, you want to make sure you don't puncture that. Now, I'm going to work up towards the uh, top here, going up the brisket. Going to switch the knives here. Just a little bit. A little bit bigger. All right, now I'm gonna turn this, turn the squirrel around. Take that gut hook, put it under there. Grab the bottom torso and just rip right up the top there. Now you see how that just cut right through. All right, now getting up to the neck here, and this knife just cuts right through there like it's nothing. You can sever the head off, unless you're going to mount it. Sever the head, head off. And don't worry about that going through bone. It'll go right through it. Alright. Now, once you finish your cut, right there, 
you can start skinning it. And you gotta cut the other leg off. And that's going right through bone. That's going right through bone. And just rock it. There we go. And now, I'm going to switch back over to my other knife and I'm going to take this little this little knife and just cut right up the legs just like I did with the back leg but put it off to the side there go up the legs there then go up the other leg make like I said make sure you know where you point that knife because it's just it's as sharp as can be and now we're ready take all the entrails out now we're ready to take all the entrails out and finish that squirrel all right take my scroll and cut the pelvis there without you can bend it and try and break that bone but you don't want to you don't want to waste that 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 bag there you don't want to break that open you can just go ahead and lean over to the side there and if you want cut it right off you just lean it over to the side just like this go ahead and grab it and cut it right off and let that go to the edge there okay so you, that'll make sure that you don't get it over your meat. Now that just went off on the ground. So now, break this vent. Break that pelvis. And get down through there. So you can get that, get that vent out. want that right out of there all right and now you're ready to detach all of this so if you grab the esophagus and pull right on down just like you do a deer pull right on down and all of it will come right on out just like that now you have it out and that's how to fill dress your squirrel alright now we're gonna go ahead and skin this off and and uh, soak it in salt water and vinegar